At 7.59 a.m. on December 26, 2004, a massive underwater earthquake strikes off the west coast of Indonesia's Sumatra Island. The quake is the world's biggest in four decades. It lasts nearly 10 minutes, displacing billions of tons of water along a line of ocean trench as long as Italy. The 9.15 magnitude quake causes the entire planet to vibrate, releasing energy equivalent to 23,000 Hiroshima-type atomic bombs and triggering other earthquakes as far away as Alaska. This map shows the events that occurred over the hours that followed. At 8.15 local time, waves as high as six-story buildings hit northern Sumatra, plowing inland in places for up to three kilometers or two miles. The disaster will claim almost 166,000 lives in Indonesia. To the north, tidal waves slam into India's Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Waves traveling as fast as jet planes roar across the Indian Ocean. They slow down and gain height as they reach shallow water, striking the coasts of Sri Lanka, Thailand and mainland India. A combined 60,000 people will perish in those countries. In the third hour, the tsunami strikes Bangladesh, where two children die. Scientists attribute the relatively low death toll to a shallow seabed and to the north-south orientation of the quake's fault line. Waves heading to the east and west from the quake zone are far more destructive than those traveling northwards. Myanmar is also spared the full brunt of the tsunami as the Andaman Islands to the south absorb much of the impact. Even so, 61 people die there. At 11.21 Indonesia time, seismologists record a 7.1 magnitude aftershock. Ten minutes later, the tsunami hits the Maldives, killing 108 people. The waves surge across the low-lying island nation, completely inundating 73 of the 199 inhabited islands. Slowed down by Sumatra, the tsunami finally works its way to Malaysia, where it kills more than 70 people. On the other side of the Indian Ocean, Waves eventually smash into Mauritius, the Seychelles, Madagascar, and continental East Africa. Somalia is the worst hit. Seven hours after the earthquake, almost 300 Somalis die and thousands are made homeless. In all, the tsunami claims 226,000 lives in 13 countries and displaces almost 2 million more. It triggers an unprecedented outpouring of aid, some $14 billion dollars. Five years after the worst natural disaster in living memory, many communities are still struggling to recover. Now choose a category for a more detailed breakdown of the tsunami's impact by numbers.